Hi, I'm Austin Motley, Principal Trombone of the Battle Creek Symphony Orchestra. I hope you're staying healthy and listening to lots of music during this time of social distancing. In this brief video, I'll be telling you a little bit about the trombone and what makes it so special compared to the other instruments. <laughs> The trombone was invented in Europe over 500 years ago. It is a member of the brass family because it's made out of brass. Due to its range, in other words, how high and low it can play, the trombone is more specifically considered to be part of the low brass family, which also consists of baritones, euphoniums, and tubas. Trombones are unique from all other wind instruments due to the slide. The slide is controlled by the right arm instead of the fingers, like all other wind instruments. This allows for the trombone to play perfectly in tune and to play some pretty cool sounds, such as a glissando. <laughs> There are seven slide positions on the trombone that function as valve and key combinations, like on other brass and woodwind instruments. Although there are only seven slide positions, there is an infamous eighth position club, of which many trombonists, including myself, attest to being a part. The eighth position club is when you accidentally let go of the slide and it falls off onto the floor. My only advice is don't let go of the slide. Although the trombone is considered to be part of the low brass family, that doesn't mean it can play only low notes. The trombone is one of the most versatile instruments because it has such a wide range. It can play low notes like the tuba, and it can play very high notes like the trumpet. The trombone is also very versatile because it plays in a variety of musical styles and genres, such as band, orchestral, jazz, pop music, and more. Here's a clip of me playing a song on the trombone and euphonium that everyone should recognize. Notice how I use the slide with my right hand to move to different notes instead of my fingers. Also see if you can point out when I glissando to certain notes. <laughs> I hope this video taught you something new about the trombone and maybe even sparked an interest to continue learning more about it. If that's the case, I highly encourage you to go to YouTube and check out trombone videos. I do every day and I can't get enough. With all that said, I hope you continue to stay well and make plans to come see the Battle Creek Symphony Orchestra in our 2020-21 season. Goodbye for now.